Hello, Wolfie. Level two wolf. Whoop. What's up, Survivor Fanatics? This is KG48, and welcome back to my subsistence. Let's play. What? What? Subsistence? Here we go for some hardcore survival. I hope you guys are ready. Last video, we did a bit of base expansion here. We just need three more pieces of roofing, and this place is a nice little uh, starter base for us. I like it. We will be expanding later, but for now, this will do just fine. Got some windows to shoot out of. We got some stuff to look around. Nice lake over there. I'm, I'm digging it. I'm digging it. This video, we're going to do some farming this video, but we're going to talk about a new update and it's a pretty big update okay um cold games has added in a new predator the mountain lion or cougar i forget which one it's called but kind of the same thing big lion we got to or not a lion but a big uh big uh cat we got to be careful we got to stay away from them and they are supposedly hang out more in the uh i think he said they hang out in elevated regions i'm thinking he, they might be hanging out by the big uh the big mountain over there, and I'm hoping so because I do not want to tangle with them. They're supposed to be really, really nasty, okay? They drop a new thing called, I think they drop sinew, although they drop something, and I don't see a, I don't see a recipe for sinew, so I'm assuming they actually drop the sinew. And you use sinew for some recipes, you also use sinew to make rope, and there's going to be a couple things we're not going to make without sinew anymore. Solar panels, that hurts. That freaking hurts. That hurts my soul. Okay, because I don't know what I'm going to need to kill one of those things, but, you know, I don't think I'm going to be able to kill them without maybe some armor or something, and, you know, I'm very nervous about it. I have no plans to kill them right now or anytime soon, to be perfectly honest, but that means no solar panels for us for probably a very long time, which really, really hurts. Um, solar panels are pretty powerful, though, so I guess that does make sense. Also, we can't make a wellhead. Um, I could just make canteens. Uh, so the wellhead, the wellhead automatically gives you water, but it also takes power. And with canteens, I don't need it that much, I don't think. Um, we also can't make animal housing, which kind of sucks. But the animal housing, the wellhead, and the solar panels, more of a later game thing. It, it's, not, it's not too bad right now. We'll see how it goes. Um, it's not, it shouldn't be that big of a deal. And it's also used in a lot of these, uh, a lot of clothes. Now, I think it makes a lot of sense in the clothes because before you would just make the best clothes because there was no point. Now there's some actual um, progression with the clothes. As a matter of fact, I think the, I think the light t-shirt should be even cheaper and so should the light pants. I think we should be able to make those pretty easily. And honestly, four cloth and six cloth is not that cheap it's not that good for beginner stuff there should be those should be truly beginner stuff in my opinion also there should be shoes that are not leather boots leather boots are the only shoes you can make so until you basically until you can kill a mountain lion which is going to be very difficult you can't make shoes um that's a problem for me uh, other than that though um seems like a really interesting update let's go ahead and feed this fire oh there's also a new thing i <laughs> this one i don't like i i really don't like but we'll see how it goes planks now take three logs instead of two and you might be thinking, well, come on, man. Like, uh, chopping down trees is already a pain in the ass. It's boring. It's not fun. I, I just don't like it. And it's one, of the th it's one of the things I don't show you guys on camera because it's so boring and pointless. And just just boring. It's the only word I can think of. Um, but, but what he did was he actually made it so you don't have to pick up the wood anymore off the ground. All right? Is that going to make it fast enough to make that one extra wood uh, per plank worth it? I don't know. I don't know. Only time will tell. My gut reaction was kind of anger um i was getting good at catching the wood anyway to be perfectly honest oh by the way i wonder is sinew gonna drop in crates i don't think i'm almost positive it's not but that would be interesting if it did anyway um yeah so my my original reaction was anger and frustration um i was getting pretty good at catching the logs i didn't think it was that big of a deal and i don't like the uh, i don't like um more expensive um planks because you know it just takes a long time anyway, but I want to build like really big bases though. And I want it all right now. So I'm just being a little impatient. I get that. So we'll see where it goes. I, uh, I didn't think that was a change really needed to be honest. Um, some people are really upset in the forums. This game, the, 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 the fans of this game are some of the hardest core fans of survival games I've ever seen. The fans of this game want everything harder. It's never hard enough. They always want it harder. It's too easy. Um, just all the time with these, with these fans. And, um, you know, they're passionate. Uh, and uh, they are pissed off at this change. They don't like it. They're, they think it's, they think picking up the wood is challenging. It, it opens you up to attack. Um, now, my, my personal opinion, and take this with a grain of salt, because I've only, I've only ever played on normal difficulty. But my personal, just my opinion, 
I don't think it. I don't think picking up wood has ever added challenge to the game. I think it's just been boring and pointless. Um, but I don't play on hardcore. Um, hardcore might be a little, might be a different story. So um, I think cold games is going to make the ability to have to pick up the wood or not uh, toggleable, and uh, maybe he'll even put it in hardcore and leave us to it. I I don't want to have to pick up the wood, but if it means spending one more piece of wood on planks, then I don't like the change and I wish it would go back. But We'll see where it goes. I'm gonna see. Uh, we'll do some. We're gonna do some chopping down today. Again, I don't, I don't normally show you guys chopping down of wood, but we're gonna show it today because it, it should be pretty interesting. It should be pretty interesting. Let's chop that. Let's chop some right now. Okay. Wait, what? Oh, okay. So you. Just, oh, I see. It still pops out. You just get it automatically. Yeah. Okay. So. It does make it a little faster because even people who are good at catching the logs, at least me, I mean, I'm pretty decent at catching logs, but I never catch them all. So, like, normally I'd be, I'd be axing, all right, and at the third, the last axe, I would have to look around and pick up some wood, and that does slow me down. So, um, I don't know, maybe. I mean, we'll see, we'll have to see how it goes. It's definitely going to make cutting wood faster. There's no doubt about that. I, even me, I, I was pretty good at catching wood, but I would not catch all of them. So... We'll see. We'll see. One thing I know about Cold Games, I will give his updates a chance because uh, he's made he's made uh, decisions in the past that I didn't agree with, and I ended up loving him. Kind of like the he's kind of like the fun pimps in that way. In that way, um, they've made some decisions that I really hated, and uh, I ended up loving them. So I'm gonna give Cold Games the benefit of doubt, and I gotta tell you right now, cutting some wood here, I'm kind of I'm think I'm okay with it. Maybe I think I might be okay with it. It just that extra wood, just mm, mm. the thing is, y you're not supposed to be building up this ridiculous base so quickly, you know. I mean, like people like me who've been playing this game for a long time, we want to build like really big, awesome bases all the time because we've built bases before. We always want to try something bigger and newer and cooler, um, and you know, it takes some time. So, all right, we gotta catch this chicken. Should I try and catch him? Yeah, let's try and catch him. Catch him. All right, chicken. Don't run me into that wolf, you damn chicken. No, no, no. You're going the wrong way. Got him. Oh, did you see all the feathers pop all over the place? Cool. I like that, Cold Games. That's cool. Good job, my man. Damn. I like that. It's a little small things like that that, that make me happy. All right. I guess I'm okay with this. Just, I don't know. <laughs> Needing that extra wood. All right, you. All right, so there's a bear on the other side of that rock. We'll see where this chicken goes. It looks like he's heading right for him, but he's not gonna get him. You're not gonna get to him, chicken. A fool like a Kentucky Fried Idiot. I'm gonna keep saying that until someone tells me what movie that's from. <laughs> yeah, maybe I won't. I don't know. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and make some sticks. I'll tell you, it makes the sticks a little bit better now. Because the sticks, I always thought needing a whole log for a stick was kind of ridiculous. But, you know, now sticks don't seem so bad because you only need one log. It's only a third of what you need for planks. That's <laughs> yeah, still ridiculous. <laughs> sticks, like one log should go into like six sticks. Alright. Let me uh, get comfy in my chair because I got to pay attention, guys. This is one game where you have to pay attention or you'll be dead as a door now and I should have the hunters around too as well so we got to be careful for them number seven is to heal number eight is to stop bleeding I need to remember that cloth is gonna be a big deal we need to start getting some cloth I will probably kill a wolf today yeah I'm, I'm gonna kill a wolf today I should get some cloth from a wolf all right anything up here seems pretty quiet to me almost too quiet oh look at those nails Nails four, you know what? For days, yeah. All right, guys, I'm gonna keep a lookout for some ore because I I mined some ore earlier and I and I realized I didn't mention it. Okay, and I keep forgetting that there's a lot of new people watching this series um, on my channel. Although the series isn't getting a lot of views, but there are a lot of people who are new. And maybe if I explain things better, um, I could keep a little bit more of the audience because um, yeah, I've actually uh. I've actually done a few things here and didn't explain things like, um, you know, there's new people watching, which I definitely should. I definitely should. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to grab some wood here and I'm going to run up. I'm going to run up and feed the fire just to make sure everything is kosher. Uh, I'll probably drop some stuff off too, I guess. 
Why not? Let's get on up here. Drop oh, we got a chest up here. That's nice. That is really cool. Right next to my base. Love it. Awesome. What, what? Chest for days. All right, we're walking in with um, 22 nails. Not bad. Not bad. How many arrows do we have? Three? Okay. All right, so we did make one set of arrows. So that was two nails we used for that. All right, so let's get on up here. I need to make that second set of stairs. I'm getting annoyed with that, uh, having to jump up on that. There we go. All right, so that's pretty much full. We're going to come over here and dump this stuff off as quickly as possible. I do not want to um, bore people food going the other one. That's the um, iron ore right there. As a matter of fact, let's just put it right in here. Turn it on, and there you go. That's how it mines the ore. All right, let's drop this stuff in here quickly. I'll come back and mess around with that later. Let's drop these in just in case I die. Awesome. I think we'll have enough to make our uh, the rest of our roof today, which would be pretty cool. That would be really nice. All right, so what are we looking at here? Okay. Okay. Let's continue looking around. I'm not seeing a lot of ores on the stone, on the rocks. Oh, there's one. All right, so you get your pickaxe right here, guys. I made the pickaxe. If you want to make a pickaxe, that's what it takes. Okay? And you just come right here. Now, it's you have to be pretty close to these to, to hit them. If you don't see the white bar going around the circle, you got to get closer. There you go. See that little white bar? you got to see that or else it's not actually doing it. There we go. we got some more iron ore. Five pieces of iron ore. Oh, here's another one. Cool. It's weird I'm only seeing iron ore. Isn't that strange? I mean, iron ore is the one I want more than anything. Um, but you can't... Man cannot live on iron ore alone. I'm also going to need... Uh, the other stuff as well. Um, okay, let's be careful here. Okay, black bear. Should we take the wolf now? Nah. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait for the wolf till the, till the very end of the video, so I don't have to walk around with um, wolf meat in my bag, um, worrying if it's gonna go bad. I also want to hit a lot more trees, but even though, even though uh, it's a little bit easier now with the trees because you don't have to pick up the wood, I still feel it's kind of just. Blech. I'll do that off camera. I need to do a full day of farming um, in between this and the next video. That doesn't mean I'm going to get to it, but I'm going to try. All right, so we got more, more. We got some more ore up here. I don't think I'm going to be able to get up there though. Yeah, at least not from this side. I'm going to let it go. You waste a lot of time trying to get to ore, like on a rock face like that, and maybe you can never do it. I was thinking about going around the other, the other side, like the back, and maybe trying to get up that way, but yeah, it's just not worth it. Okay. I don't know. I'm I you know honestly I can't decide which way I like better now. I really I really like not having to look for the wood to pick up. I really do. But I don't like having to use uh what is that, fifty percent more wood? Math is hard for me. But I'm pretty sure if you use two logs and then you're using three, that's fifty percent more. So yeah. Um I don't like that. <laughs> but eh. I don't hate it though. I don't hate it. Cold games. I got your back, bro. I got your back. Cold Games is the developer of the game. Oh, there's a lock chest. Damn it. That's what I need the iron ore for, by the way. Well, I need iron ore for quite a few things, but one of the things is the lock chests. Um, in order to make the keys, you need iron ore. I got a little scared there. I thought something was around me, but... All right, rabbit, don't you move. Damn it, I told you not to move. Didn't save you. Okay, you're coming with me. Come with me, rabbit. Honestly, I'm not even really killing the rabbit for the food anymore. I'm killing it for the... I mean, the food will be nice. I'm not going to lie. But I'm more killing it for the cloth. Because I want to I want to get some clothes. I want to get some clothes for sure. I am thinking about skipping the tier 1 clothes, to be honest. Um, the tier 2 clothes are obviously better. But they t the problem with the tier 2 clothes is they take... Um, uh, they take feathers... To make the tier two clothes when the tier one clothes do not, so I gotta I gotta think about that because I you know I can't make an animal housing for quite a while now because of uh because of the, the change to needing sinew, um uh, so I can't I don't you know that's why I'm trying to catch every chicken I come across by the way um, because I really need the feathers if I can get some feathers I could I can make that tier two stuff all right he's gonna run me right into the fence by the way this fence is the um, edge of the world. It's just a, uh, you know, it's just a placeholder. Um, but you can't get past it. And sometimes he's opened it up. He's, like, expanded the map in certain places. The map used to be smaller. But, um, yeah, so. One guy, one one man is make, is developing this game, guys. He really, he listens to his fans more than any other developer I've ever heard of. 
Um, sometimes I think he listens a little too much to his fans, but you know, you can't fault the developer for listening to his fans. I will never, never fault the developer for that. So, you know, he listens to his fans more than anybody. He's got a full-time job, and I'm sure he's got some kind of life, girlfriend, wife, who knows. Um, you know, so the guy's like, this is, he's, he's, he has referred to this with me as a passion project, and he's quite passionate about it. He works really hard on it, so, um, he's, you know, I, I gotta say, um, other than the fun pimps, he might be my favorite developer. And, um, no, no, uh, no slight to the, to cold games, but, you know, they are the fun pimps. I mean, <laughs> seven days to die. <laughs> and no slight to the fun pimps, saying I would think about that. It's not, like, if you, if you ask me normally, like, oh, do you like this developer more or the fun pimps? Oh, the fun pimps. Like, hands down. But with cold games, I'd actually have to think about it. And that, that means a lot. <laughs> Anyone who knows how I feel about the Fun Pimps in 7 Days to Die knows that that is a big effing deal. Am I just missing the ores, guys? Or, are there, or, or have there not been a lot around? Oh, Wolfie. You know what, Wolfie? I think it's time. Duck. Aim. One shot. Alright. He lagged right, right at the end there, too. I thought I was going to get hit, but not so much. Not so much, Wolfie. I want some meat. I want some cloth. I want some... Oh, uh, no cloth. Damn it. Hmm. I wonder if wolves, do wolves don't give cloth anymore if I just got, like, unlucky. I probably just got unlucky. I, mean, I don't think he would just make wolves not drop cloth. Needing to kill a bear for cloth would be... Insane. <laughs> so, I don't think that's the case, though. Alright, chicken. All right, that chicken's gonna run me right into... I'm not even gonna bother. He, he had, like... Four big animals over there. Maybe not four, but he had two I could see. Two big animals over there that he could have ran me into. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to save my time. I'm not going to bother. There's two wolves. What are those two wolves doing? Are they mating? They're not moving. I think they're stuck. I wonder if those wolves are stuck. Or maybe they're mating. Maybe they're going to make a little tiny wolf at level like a half. He'll be level one half. All right, we got to be quiet here. I gotta listen. Shh. Gotcha. Oh man, a lot of chickens, man. Hey, Cold Games, did you up the uh, small animals? And if you did, God bless you, my friend. God bless you. I love the small animals. They're awesome. I like shooting the bow. I like the challenge of trying to catch them. One, you gotta shoot with an arrow. One, you have to, like, chase. Um, I feel like they're challenging because the one you have to shoot with the bow the bow is not exactly easy to use um and the one you have to chase he could run you into other animals all right there's some potassium that's good i really need some uh i don't know if it's brass or copper honestly i don't remember i think it's brass no copper nah it's probably copper yeah i think it's copper brass is an brass is something you make right copper is something you dig up but honestly i don't remember i always get those two mixed up i'm not really sure why Damn! I am getting good with this bow, guys! Very happy about that. Very good. Very good. Now we'll start heading home. I'm assuming tomorrow I'll start seeing, uh... I'll start seeing the, um... I wanted to call them bandits, but hunters, I mean. Come on, you. Don't run me into anything. I gotta be quiet. I gotta listen. Because if he runs me into anything, the first thing I'll know I'll, I'll hear is the growl. Rabbit's not going to save you, bro. I don't know what you think about running me into a rabbit. Alright. Alright, let's start heading home. Okay. Look good, people. Looking good. Keep a look out for some more ore. I think that's a lock chest. Yeah, I'm almost positive it's a lock chest. You always see these damn lock chests when you don't have the, when you don't have the key. You ever notice that? I mean, they're expensive to open. The keys are expensive. He I, there was a bear right in front of me. That's why I, I got kind of a little nervous right there. I had trouble picking him up. <laughs> I saw the bear. I was like, oh, yeah. oh god, I got no stamina. That's stupid. Don't ever run out of stamina like this, guys. Uh, dumb, dumb, dumb. 
So if I ran into that bear, I would have been I would have been up you know what's creek without a paddle. And stamina's taking a while to come back, so I'm probably quite hungry. Uh but I need protein more than anything. Um I'm gonna eat this anyway. It will help me get some stamina back quicker. Anytime I don't have stamina, guys, anytime you don't have stamina, go ahead and hit a tree. Hit a couple trees. Wait for your stamina to come up. I call this the game edge. The game edge move. I know you guys are probably getting sick of me saying that's the game edge move, but I want to give props to my buddy because it's a really good idea. Oh, here we go. Finally found me some copper. This stuff is really needed. Honestly, the thing I really needed copper most for was the, um... Was the, um... Uh, the... Bu -bu 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 Damn, I can't remember. The, um... Solar panels, right? But the thing about it is now I can't make solar panels until I can kill cougars. So, I keep calling them cougars. They are cougars, right? I forget what you call them. I think he called them cougars, but I'm not really sure. I always thought Mountain Lion was a cooler name, but... I think we're talking about the same thing, so it's irrelevant. I've gotten quite a lot of stuff on this run, guys. Like, I don't usually get to the point where my inventory is almost full. A lot of good stuff. It's been a good run. Not a lot of nails, though, unfortunately. That's what I... Honestly, that's what I need the most is the damn nails. But that's okay. We'll get some. We'll get some. That's another thing. I think you use iron, you can make your own nails. So that's one thing we're trying to work towards. I think the next thing I'm probably going to need is either the mass fabricator or or an electricity expansion thingy. I forget what it's called. You know, thing, so I can exp I can have more electric. All right. Should we call this one here or should we keep going? I'm not really worried about that meat going bad yet. It really shouldn't. So I think we're going to keep going. I mean, honestly, I could kill another wolf if I wanted to. Wouldn't be a terrible idea, actually. I mean, I can save those, those animals. Don't forget, those animals don't go bad. Um, as long as you don't kill them, uh, they'll keep forever. So... Is this potassium or iron? I can't really tell. It looks like iron, maybe? I hope it's iron. Potassium's needed too, but you mostly need potassium for gunpowder. Yeah, iron, okay. Cool. I need iron more. I mean, I need potassium, but I need iron more. As of right now, anyway. Let's grab some more wood. Just so we have some wood during the night. How much did I How many uh, planks did I make? Seven? Yeah. Ooh, really need a lot of wood for planks, but... You need more wood for planks, but you do get it faster. There's no way. There's no way around that. I don't think anybody caught every piece of wood. And if you did, then this is a really... If you were catching every piece of wood, this is a terrible update for you. Because <laughs> basically, Cold Games is saying, Alright, you don't have to catch the wood anymore. And then you're all like, but I can catch the wood. And then Cold Games is like, well, too bad. It takes three wood now to make a plank. So deal with it. <laughs> and then the sunglasses come down over Cold Games' uh, face and a blunt goes in his mouth and it says, deal with it. And then rap music plays. And that way, that's the way those videos go, right? Yeah. I really like to kill another wolf before the end of this, but I don't know. I'm not seeing any. I'm really glad I didn't, I didn't build up there. Oh, there's a wolf right there. Should we kill another one? I think we're going to kill another one. We need the protein. So. All right. Yeah, let's kill this sucker. I think two wolf kills will go, go really nice right about now. Hello, wolfie. Level two wolf. Whoop. Okay, well he got me. Um, he didn't get me good enough. I do not have to use any healing items. Now, the thing that sucked about that was I used two shotgun shells. He was really low. He was really low when I was shooting at him. I'm not sure why. I thought I was ducking. Maybe I wasn't. I'm not really sure. But, um, yeah, that's why I missed the first one. He was really low. So I used two shotgun shells, which really sucks. But, at the same time, I didn't have to use any healing items, which is nice. Most of the time when you miss a wolf, you're probably going to have to use a healing item. Um, so, it's actually really good that I didn't have to. Alright, I'm going to turn off my timer right now because we're going to um, go over already, I can tell. Let's go ahead and make some cordage. Uh, make some more planks. We'll save eight for the night. That should be plenty for the wood burning stove. I'm getting some, some more now, so it doesn't matter. And I think we want to make our roof. I think that would be really nice to make our roof. Unless we need it for something else that I was maybe thinking about making, but not really sure. I definitely want another set of stairs and possibly a um, possibly a um, platform. 
But the roof is first. The roof is definitely first. All right, home sweet home. Look at this thing, man. Woo! Hells yeah. All right, so let's go ahead and put this uh, food on here, and I'm going to try my best not to forget it's in there. Um, we did get a piece of cloth from that last wolf, which was nice. We're going to throw these guys in here. I don't know when he's going to fix this, but I'm going to be sad the day he does fix this, by the way. You might be wondering what this stuff down here. This stuff down here is ash, and that is going to be used as fertilizer when I get a plant grow bed thingy. Um, as a matter of fact, we should take some out of here. No, take some out of here. There we go. Put some down here. Okay, looking good. Let's go grab some water because we can. Okay. All right, looking good. Oh, look at that. That's, um, what is that called? That blue stuff? I forget. It's called something. I, I thought it starts with an A, but I can't remember. I should probably mine it. I could. I got the time to. Yeah, why not? Let's mine it. It'll just take a second if I can reach it. Um, not gonna be able to reach that, am I? Oh, wow. <laughs> no, I did not just mine that, guys. Um, it, it despawned. <laughs> I don't think I, I wonder if he could make it so nothing you could look at will despawn. Like, that's just sad. I don't really need it. I probably wouldn't be able to reach it anyway, but still. Still makes me cry. Okay, there we go. Eat. Eat. Man, look at that protein bar now. Hells yeah. Protein, yeah. Gotta hit the gym. I'll be as big as Mad Bull someday. Let's go and eat that. Okay. Um, let's go over here and let's put the iron in here. Uh, this is where I keep all this stuff as well. Um, actually, I'm going to turn this off because I might want to use the electricity for something else. Let's see what we need next. Okay, so we are working towards making nails. In order to make nails, we need to be able to make a workbench. All right? In order to make workbench, we need another power storage and a mass fabricator. <sighs> Which one would be first? Mm, that's a tough call, actually. I, I don't know. I don't think it really matters, to be honest. Um, let's go with the mass fabricator. Yeah, I'll make the mass fabricator first. Alright, the mass fabricator is going to take power. Um, it's going to take power, the electricity, and it's going to turn it into mass. But you don't do it before your mass is at 100, or you're kind of wasting your time. I mean, you could. I should have made a light in here. Damn it. Uh, yeah, I probably should have made a light. Yeah, whatever. Right, let's go on over here. Let's drop this in here. That's good. Uh, there we go. Get some good water. We don't really need the water right now, but I'm probably going to make multiple canteens. Um, how expensive are canteens? I know they're cheap, but... Oh, they're really cheap. Okay. Um, let's make a couple more. Why not? I don't have a ton of cordage, but I've got enough. Um, let's make two more canteens. I think that'll go nicely. Alright, so we got a lot of feathers. You know what, guys? I think we might be able to make the medium armor. Um, so this thing takes six, and this takes ten cloth. Hmm. See, the thing is, I want to make the medium armor, but I'm afraid if I die fighting a mountain lion or a cougar, uh, I'm afraid that I'll lose it. You know what I mean? So, I'm not really sure. I'll, have to think, I'll think about that off camera. Let's go ahead and make some bullets as well. Um, we actually have quite a quite a few 9 mil. Um, so I think I'm going to make some shotgun shells. There we go. We're going to need those to hunt wolves, and we're going to want to hunt wolves. So, Okay. Okay, throw you in there. Throw you in there. All right, we've got a lot of food uh, actually set up. That's really nice. I'm really, I'm really pleased with how much food I have set up so far. This is actually going better than last season at this point. Um, I do not have a lot of nails, unfortunately. Let's see if we can go ahead and make our three ceilings. Uh, ceiling. One, two, three. Stairs for the front. Come on. Stairs. And one more foundation. Wow. We had a lot more than I thought. <laughs> okay, well, that went well. That went very well. Let's go ahead and put down this, uh... This bad boy, uh, I don't really know where I want to put it. 
Uh, I guess I could put it over here. Uh, nah, I'll put it right here. That's good. Alright, now you just, if you turn this on, it'll use power and it'll give you, it'll take power and it'll give you mass. Uh, it'll take a lot more power than it's going to give you mass though. Um, and again, don't use it until your mass is at, is at 100 unless you really, really have to. Alright, so we'll take that out. We'll take this out. How much biofuel do I have? Right, I'm starting to save up some biofuel. That's good. Um, you could use biofuel to get power out of the generator. But again, I probably wouldn't do it until your power is at 500. Otherwise, you're kind of wasting your time. And honestly, I wouldn't use it at all right now um, until I can get a power storage made. Which I'm just waiting for electricity and, um, and mass for the power storage. Alright, let's go ahead and put these ceilings up. You guys said my ceilings are going the wrong way. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Okay. So, dismantle. That's okay. I'll remove those later. I'm not going to bother now. I This video is going way too long anyway. Alright, guys. There is the roof. It is complete. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you guys next time. And until then, take it easy.